Alrighty, let's play this. There's no sound here. And and off. Cool. Yeah, it's much better. It's cool. I like it. I think I only have some some uh, what's it called timing timing questions. I like. I mean, the guy he's clearly in frame. That's all cool. She comes in in the corner. I think what I would do is, my thing is she she comes in pretty fast, she gets fairly low. If this was a different color and you can see the actual ground and you do a fake uh, cast shadow, it feels like she would be fairly close. To me it feels like I wouldn't go lower than this. Also the color silhouette will be nicer than right through there. And keep the timing, but personally I wouldn't go lower than this and that will slow her down. And I know you, know, you want a little bit of curve so it's not down flat over there. But if you can somehow make it work that it's a bit more like that. You know, even this is fairly edgy there. So imagine she would come through there. I know she's fast. I would cheat this. The moment you hit that kind of down slope through here, where everything kind of slows down anyway, set your cheat key there. And then so that this is slower. Because that is really fast. You also don't get really to enjoy that. It's almost like an attack. Boom! Like you would have that frame. His hair would just be ah, and eyes. Ah. The other things to me, the things that are too fast. It feels like that drop there, and then that's too fast. And because of that speed, we suddenly just flip right away to this. We're missing. To some degree, the pan. We're definitely missing her pirouette there into this. So what I would do personally, I would slow this down. Cheat if you have to. Well, you have to cheat. Just change the timing, but slow it down. We get to appreciate this a bit longer. Watch out that she actually looks at him head turn a bit more. And then that. So we get that a bit more for a couple frames. That exit there. A pan a bit slower. And then I would just put in more fake cubes or trees or whatever so we understand the camera move because once we hear you know is that just her doing this it does feel nice we are a bit straight here falling very straight so you want a bit of a something in there like something something whatever you want to do in there so it's not super straight one axis and to me with all that momentum to me it feels like she would be turn a bit of a drop so that, what is she doing here? See that? How she has that that fall and lean backwards going this way? That to me would be because her drop would be in space here-ish or whatever, right? Whatever it is, but still going from here to here, if that makes sense. Like in 2D space, I would have her go left or right into that. Just a bit. Because that's great. This gets a bit bouncy on the hat. Doink, doink, doink. Watch out. It's a cute walk backwards. I wonder if it's a bit too head forward there where she's almost... It's almost like she's sneaking back. Okay. But it's not bad. I don't know. That's more of a very subjective thing. Well, that's cute. I like that. I will probably slow it down a bit right through there. So it's... Da, 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 all right. And go. Versus now it's... Da, 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 and go. I'm out. <laughs> so I'll just give this a bit more of a slight slow down through this. And then... Shoo, and that's that. And I'll probably give this, she exits on that last frame. They have one, two, three, I don't know. To me, I would give this another five frames of empty, of emptiness. It feels like we cut right out. You know, whatever shot you would have on your reel. I think we can just linger a tiny bit more. Might just be me. I don't know. Or not. I don't know. This is one of those subjective things. I feel like when I watch this for the first time, we go straight into this. I don't know. It feels like it's such a nice, you know, slow, gentle, Exit with what she's doing here that we might not want to cut out right away Subjectively, I know that's what I have uh, and other than that. That's it. Thank you All right, there's an email you can sign up you can start whenever you want you can submit whatever you want You get 16 submissions either way a like and subscribe would be awesome. All right. Thank you